we're gonna get there at eight o'clock, o'clock and it's only gonna be a four-hour flight. Like, how does that even happen? Okay. The ocean is seventy-five percent of the world, and we are traveling over it in four hours. I usually travel over the ocean in twelve hours. Not personally, but the pilot. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! You will not believe what the pilot, what the captain just said. He just said that this is the first flight ever using this plane. This plane has never been used. Like, it looks so new, like look at these TVs. Yeah. This is Adam Montreal and we'll see you there. Good evening ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to 918, uh, sorry not 18, but 812 with service to the Reykjavik Kaffovic. Guys, so we just got off this plane. So tired, but we don't get to sleep right now because we have to go to a place oh. called a Blue Lagoon, no. which is That's basically funny. a volcano oh. with water. So I don't. I think it's like a dormant volcano, or it might be like what? So I had a totally different image of what Iceland was like before I got here. I think I should have looked at some pictures. But just look out the window and you'll see because it's or not so, so far it's not that nice. It's literally rocks that have been like overturned and just like thrown everywhere and then like moss has grown on top. Just look at it. Amazing. Thank you for Nice. Nice desert. I'm just kidding, it's tundra, but same thing. Honestly, probably are. over the Blue Lagoon, we're about to make it there. I look to my left and what do I see? I mean, clouds are supposed to be in the sky, right? But no, they're on the ground. What? What is that? What is that? Is that a cloud coming out of the ground? Look at that huge mountain over there. That's so crazy. I mean, it, I know it just looks like a like Mars, like it's like it, it, like it's an eruption or like something from Mars. It does. It's kind of crazy. Like it, like it looks like it looks like slime, like really gross, kind of. It's kind of weird. People say that there hasn't been sun in like three weeks. You get to say that you're walking in between. Oh, look at that. The water is literally like a light pastel blue color. And we're gonna get we're gonna get some GoPro footage under the water so so we can bring you along with us and you can feel like you are there. What is up guys? Right now we are in the blue look at We're going in in it's really cold Iceland. It's like 40 in the, it's in the 40s, but inside the lagoon it's like in the 90s. It's so it's very warm. And like I don't know if you can see but you can see steam rising. And the camera might get fogged. But you Over can there, see if you see those two, two uh, clouds of smoke, um, that is releasing pressure from underground. But if you look around, you can see beautiful mountains everywhere. It's so and it's just crazy. so amazing. So cool. Is they have two, like one bridge over there, and you can go in there, and there's a, that one has like a little waterfall. That bridge, there is a little water fountain with like fresh natural spring water. That's really good. There's a whole bar. There's a bar with drinks of all types, not just for adults. So they have really good drinks. Um, I just keep you hydrated. Yeah, we got like slushies and juices. They're really good. They have like a mud mask or like a silicone mask that you can put on your face, and then when you when after like 10 minutes or 15 minutes are done, you just go under the water and you wash it off, and then. Your face later feels like before, like nice and clean is like uh, it, it's supposed to like remove wrinkles. So let's go try that out. Yes. It's really cool. Look at me. This looks on mask, just put it on. I put a little bit on my shoulders and like a little bit on my neck and on my other shoulder too. Hey guys, so it's been about five minutes. She said, the lady says that for me, since I'm a little bit younger, um, it should be five minutes. I think for adults it's 10 to 15. So um, I'm gonna take it off now. And the water is just a little bit salty. You can still put your head under. It's just obviously best not to open your eyes. Yeah, so I have contact lenses in. So um, we actually have goggles. But you can't see under like if I have my face, my hand in front of my face like this, I can't see under underwater because it's just that salty, and all the salt is actually natural, so it's actually really it's really good for you for your body to be in here. It's, like it says, pierce on your water, and it's like spring water. I don't think you can read that, but it's obviously Icelandic water is water from icebergs. It's fresh water that fills up the pool, but you can also drink it. 
some people can be in like uh they can steal on robes they have like luxury like passes and they can like they have they get robes and they get like spa treatments 12 seconds later this is such an amazing place to be if you really need relaxation i know it's so far away but you should honestly if you haven't been you should really put it on your bucket list or put it on some sort of list that you accomplish when you're older because this is just such a beautiful and amazing and wonderful place to be at it's just so peaceful and like there's not a lot of talking there's a lot of people here but they just don't really talk that much so it's like really peaceful or really quiet it's so so cold outside but then when you just come in and sit down it's so nice and warm it's like such a beautiful contrast that like if i have half my body out especially if there's a breeze then like oh my gosh it's so cold like 40 degrees but then when you get in you're like oh my gosh like i do not want to get up and then your hands get all really bad but it's okay it's like honestly really worth it it's just such an amazing experience. One thing about your hair is they they recommended putting a conditioner in it so that it doesn't get all dry. But uh, I did that, but it's still kind of dry. So we'll just wait till we wash it out. <laughs> we'll let you know how it turned out. Uh, all right. So one more plus is that this place has really nice Instagram pictures or Facebook or whatever because the water is look at it's literally blue. But this place is just been so beautiful and so relaxing right now and so far throughout the whole entire day. We've been here for a long time. Two thousand years later. Guys, Blue Lagoon. 10 out of 10 recommendation. It was such an amazing experience. That was one of my top 10 places that I've ever been in the world. That's just such a beautiful place. Um, it was amazing. The people were great. Everybody's super nice. The only downfall of the Blue Lagoon is that your hair gets really messed up. And that's why my hair is actually in a towel right now because your hair gets all knotted and very, very dry if you don't put conditioner in it. And I did put a lot of conditioner. I just don't think I put enough. But when they say put a conditioner, if you go, remember to put a lot, a lot of conditioner because you really do need to put conditioner. Um, right now it is actually 1.30 in the morning and look how bright it is. Like for 1.30 in any other place, it'd be pitch black. You wouldn't even be able to see your hand or another person if they were in front of you. You need to have a light on. It is literally super light outside. That is crazy. We talked to a person and they said that the only time it really gets dark is like around December, maybe like March, where it actually gets um, dark. And if it does, it'll only be dark for a few hours, not even a whole night. Um, right now we are in Reyk actually Reykjavik, which is the capital of, um, of Iceland. And we are staying in a beautiful penthouse, which has this amazing view of the mountains. So the mountains are actually covered in a layer of like cloud right now. So you can't see that far. But if you watch our vlog for tomorrow, then you will see the mountains fully and see how amazing and beautiful they are. So just stay tuned for that video. We'll be posting it very soon. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't. And watch all of our other videos if you haven't. They're really funny. Well, we think they're funny. And hopefully you do too. And also follow our Instagram and subscribe.